In the age when gods and mortals walked the earth as one, there existed a flower that captured the essence of beauty itself, Narcissus. Legend tells of Narcissus's origin, woven with threads of love, longing and tragic fate, nestled within the verdant forests of ancient Greece. It began with a nymph named Echo, whose enchanting voice could mimic the songs of birds and the rustling of leaves. Echo was blessed by the goddess Hera with this gift, yet her heart longed for companionship. One day, while wandering the woods, she encountered the handsome youth Narcissus, whose beauty rivaled that of the gods themselves. Echo, captivated by Narcissus's allure, trailed him through the forest, yearning to express her love. But Narcissus, consumed by his own vanity, spurned her advances, leaving Echo with nothing but the echo of her own unrequited affection. Heartbroken and consumed by grief, Echo retreated to the shadows of the forest, her voice fading into a mere whisper, condemned to forever repeat the words of others. Meanwhile, Nemesis, the goddess of retribution, witnessed Narcissus's callous rejection of Echo's love. Seeking to teach him a lesson, she lured him to a clear spring deep within the forest. As Narcissus bent to drink from the crystal waters, he caught sight of his reflection and was immediately entranced by the vision of his own beauty. Unable to tear his gaze away, Narcissus became transfixed by the vision, unaware that it was merely an illusion cast upon the water's surface. Day and night he remained by the spring, pining for the unreachable image, his love turning inward upon himself. In his despair, Narcissus wasted away, his once vibrant youth fading like the fleeting shadows of dusk. And as he breathed his last breath, a flower blossomed by the water's edge, its petals bearing the likeness of Narcissus's beauty, forever immortalized in the bloom that bore his name. Thus the tale of Narcissus serves as a cautionary reminder of the dangers of vanity and self-absorption and the tragic consequences that can arise from unbridled desire. Let us heed the lessons of Narcissus's folly, lest we too become ensnared by the illusions of our own reflection. The story of Narcissus carries a profound lesson that resonates deeply in our daily lives. It serves as a poignant reminder of the perils of excessive vanity and self-absorption and the detrimental effects they can have on our relationships and well-being. In a world where social media often amplifies the focus on appearance and self-image, it's easy to fall prey to the allure of seeking validation from external sources, much like Narcissus did with his own reflection. However, the story warns us of the emptiness and isolation that can accompany such pursuits, as they often lead us away from genuine connections and deeper fulfillment. Moreover, the tale underscores the importance of empathy and kindness in our interactions with others. Echo's unrequited love and Narcissus's callous rejection serve as reminders of the impact our words and actions can have on those around us. It prompts us to reflect on how we treat others, encouraging us to cultivate compassion and understanding in our relationships. Ultimately, the story of Narcissus implores us to seek balance and authenticity in our lives, to cherish genuine connections over superficial appearances, and to remain humble in the face of our own reflections. Let us share this timeless tale with our friends and family, inviting them to reflect on its wisdom and perhaps find solace and inspiration in its message. Together we can brighten each other's days with stories that resonate with the truths of the human experience.